Hi, this is Sheila Bigel. Welcome to my video tips for using the iPad. This video will discuss the iPad dock and how to change the icons that are on the dock. The iPad can have multiple screens of icons. This iPad has five screens of icons. You can tell that by noticing five dots above the gray bar of icons near the bottom of the screen. To go to the next screen of icons, I put my finger at the right of the screen and swipe to the left. To go back to the previous screen, I put my finger on the left side of the screen and swipe to the right. I can keep repeating this to go through the different screens of icons that I have. You may have noticed as I'm going from screen to screen that the icons on the screen change, but the icons that are on the gray bar at the bottom of the screen stay the same. This gray bar is known as the iPad dock. Apple originally puts the apps it thinks that you may want to use most often on the iPad dock. That way they can be reached no matter what screen you are on. You can change this and put the icons that you want to on the dock. To change the icons on the dock, you need to be able to move the icons around. And to move icons, you first have to make them jiggle. To do this, touch and hold on any of the icons on the screen. You can see that the icons are now jiggling around. Once they're doing that, you can take an icon, touch and hold it, and move it to a different part of the screen. You can also move the icons to and from the dock. So I'm going to take this icon and put it onto the dock. And I can take this icon and move it out of the dock. It's also easier to move an icon to a different screen by first moving it to the dock. So I've moved this tips icon to the dock. If I want to put this on a different screen, I can swipe to the screen I want to go to and then touch and hold that icon and move it up to the screen. Oh yes, you do want to stop the icons from jiggling. To do this, you need to touch the home button. And now everything is still again. Thank you for watching.